Kathy, will you be my friend forever? Oh, forever and ever. Why? Why be friends? That's what we're talking about today with Kathy Bartuli from the Intimacy Dojo. And Reed Mahako from readaboutsex.com. A lot of people are still operating uh, friendships like they were doing it back in fourth grade or at summer camp. And you're just like, oh my God, we have to be best friends forever. Have you ever really sat down and actually thought, what are your requirements for friendship? Why be friends with anybody? Like, what, what does a healthy friendship for you actually mean? It's really powerful when you're conscious about it. And you get to have friendships for different reasons. I have movie buddies. We don't really hang out very much, but we like the same kind of movies, and we like to go at the same times. I call them up when I say, like, The Hobbit's coming out in a couple weeks. Can we reserve Saturday night? Sure. We have a great time. I have other friends that I want to have really deep conversations with. You get to have friendships for different reasons, but just falling into a deep friendship with someone without knowing why, it's harder to know when to step out, and it's hard to know when to step, set boundaries. Another really interesting thing, um, because I teach about non-monogamy relationship styles, I actually think there's also a friendship style. You can be somebody who <clears throat> operates best when you have that one primary yeah. best friend forever. And then you can be the kind of person who's like, you know what? When the pack and I are together, that's when everything is good, when we're rolling large. And then you can be somebody who's, you know, got friends coming in and out of them. Like you're like a plutonium uh, you know, atom and there's all these electrons of friends just coming in and out of your life. And then, of course, you could also be the lone wolf. You're a pack animal, but you need your alone time. We're friends when we're together, but au revoir, my friend, until next time. <laughs> and then you may not feel like I'm your best friend, but for me, I feel like everything's great. Yeah. Are you, as you get clear about what your needs are around friendship, are, is you, are your friendship styles, are you befriending people for whom your style of friendship is a good match for theirs? Yeah. Very powerful. I'm someone who likes to have a few close friends and then a bunch of other people that I care about and turn to. Mm -hmm. So I, I'm happiest when I have a couple people that are really close to me. But if one of those people doesn't want to be in my inner circle, that could be hard. This could describe things about us. It could describe a lot. A lot of tension. I think we just helped ourselves with our own video. Thank you so much, those of you writing in these questions so that we have more to talk about we hope these videos are useful for you. Subscribe to our channel, maybe? Maybe not. If you don't subscribe, that means you're not.